She is a dental intern at King Khalid University in Al-Baha. Since 2017, she contributed to several research projects concerning smoking cessation. This year, she was a co-author of a critical review evaluating reliable methods of determining mandibular bone density. Today, we'll present, uh, she will present a research titled Assessment of Knowledge and Sorry. Oral Home Care salam, Practicing Among Saudi Pregnant Women, which is a cross-sectional study from Asir region. So you can go ahead, Dr. Jawahar. Dr. Jawahar, Smaina. Dr. Jawahar, are, are you with us? Assalamu alaikum. Wa alaikum salam. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullah. How are you, everyone? I'm Jawahar al Ahmadi. Today I will present uh, my presentation about uh, assessment of knowledge and oral health care practice among Saudi pregnant women, cross sectional study from a sea region of Saudi Arabia. If there is any question, uh, let me know in the end of the slide, okay? Uh, as we know, the pregnancy, con uh, pregnancy is a condition happen for women, not a medical disease, which is associated with the emotional and physiological change in different parts of the body, including oral cavity and dental health. Keeping good oral hygiene before and during pregnancy is very important for oral health and to avoid the black, uh, black, the black and uh, periodontal disease by brushing and flossing. In this study, we focused on the knowledge and oral health care practice of Saudi pregnant women. This study was a cross-sectional study in 300 Saudi pregnant women uh, using electronic questionnaire. Include, uh, included women above the age of 18 years uh, from the South region of Saudi Arabia. Uh, about the result, I will explain the result in the tables. Okay, here we will see the personal data of the brilliant uh, female in this study. Uh, most of the women in this study were in the range of uh, 30 to 34 years of years of age, age and uh, university educated. Major of them had no history of gingival disease, but most of them also had poor knowledge about the effect of pregnancy in oral health. As we know, uh, 
um, as we see here in the in the table, it's about uh, 65 had poor uh, knowledge about pregnancy related uh, to oral health. Yes, in this table, uh, it's about the knowledge, uh, a knowledge assessment for dental care among pregnant female in Abha. Uh, general, uh, in the general, uh, the ma majority of the female have, uh, had a good uh, oral uh, health knowledge about the meaning of the black and uh, important of brushing teeth and all of that. Uh, and uh, a lot of them, yes, a lot of them agree with the uh, with the tooth, uh, important of the tooth brushing. We had some uh, participants have a lack of information about oral health and the uh, reason may be uh, due to their uh, level of education. And about 15% uh, of the pregnant women uh, mentioned brushing their teeth once daily. And uh, about uh, 11 of them never flossed or never used the floss. In, uh, In the table four, table four, we uh, we assess the pregnant fem uh, assessment oral assessment for pregnant female. Uh, we show the oral health of pregnant women. About forty seven of the reported pre uh, presence bleeding during flossing. Uh, also, there are about uh, forty seven point nine of them have a gap between the teeth, and. Uh, 57 of pregnant women have black on the teeth. Yes, in the end, uh, Saudi pregnant women had a basic oral health knowledge, but uh, this, um, this knowledge was not associated with the self-care uh, oral hygiene procedure. And uh, I know I, I see the dentist should explain for the rule of oral health care during pregnancy is important thing. Um, thank you. And if there is any question. Thank you, Dr. Jawahar, for sharing your uh, research. Uh, we actually still have 10 minutes, which is a very good time. So if you have any questions for uh, Dr. Jawahar, and even you have the, you have the, um, if you would like to participate uh, with uh, with the voice to interact, you can raise your hand and we can open your mic as well. Any questions? I can I can see some attendees are typing, so I'm just waiting. Maybe there are some questions coming. Okay, I will take that moment to remind you to do the assessment. It is on the top of the screen. You can you can go ahead and evaluate our speaker. And behalf of the Saudi Dental Hygiene Society, we would like to thank you for sharing your valuable um, information with us this evening. And I don't see any more questions coming. So thank you, Dr. Jawahar, for your time. I think we're gonna end a little bit early tonight. I would like to remind you that inshallah to, to, um, tomorrow is our last day, day three. So be there.
Ms. Noha, you would like to add anything at the end? Everyone, uh, I really thank you all for coming, for attending, bearing with us for the three hours. Uh, you know, this uh, would not have happened without your participation and uh, attending and your support. Uh, we look forward to seeing you tomorrow in our last day. And uh, I would take this chance and tell you that tomorrow we will have um, like a survey about the conference itself. Uh, I would like each one of you, like you can think it overnight, <laughs> so I'll give you more time uh, to give us any comments or recommendations for the uh, for the future conferences or workshops. So if you have things in mind that you want or you would like to either speak about uh, yourself or to present uh, yourself or you would like us um, to find someone to talk about a certain topic, please let us know in the comments in tomorrow's uh, survey. Like our goal is um, to serve the dental hygienists. Our goal is to um, get you whatever uh, you need. And in order to do that, we need your help. So. Take the night, think it over, think of what things that you would love uh, to learn in case they were uh, general topics uh, or workshops, instrumentations, whatever it is that you think that we can um, bring to you, please let us know. We would love to hear from you. Thank you very much. Thank you, Ms. Naha. Thank you all for attending and have enjoyed the rest of your uh, weekend and we see you tomorrow inshallah. Just a reminder, still we have the surveys up there. So if you didn't take the survey, you can give us some of your time and give us your feedback. Since you're still here, if you would like to raise your hand and tell us any feedback or you have a participation, we can we can do that. Raise your hand and let's listen up. We still have like four minutes. We'll stay with you.
Thank you, Huwaida. Thank you all. So I just want to say, like, you, I just want to really, really encourage you to take this opportunity of having the society. So now the society are enabling your voice and your participation. So whenever we have call for abstracts, don't be shy. Go ahead and participate. So having students or interns at, at international conference, that's, that's not going to happen every day. So the society is really supporting all professionals so please go ahead and participate and let's all help in improving our profession because i know a lot of students they did a wonderful research projects but they're not sharing their experience or their research so this is the great opportunity for us now to participate and help our profession to develop What about attendance? What about attendance? Uh, I don't understand your question. Uh, Ms. Noha, did you understand his question? Mr. Adil? No, dear, I did not uh, understand. Maybe he means a uh, certificate for attendance? Maybe. Yes, he's asking about the certificates of attendance. Um, Insha'Allah, you will uh, receive the certificates. Um, yani they will take uh, some time if you um, if you are registered at the Saudi Commission for Health Societies and you you need the hours. The certificates for the hour CME hours are going to take some time, as the Saudi uh, Commission for Health Specialities are kind of in the middle of changing their platforms. And anyhow, uh, the process takes some time for us to raise your names um, after the, the conference is uh, completed. So it might take up to a month or so, but you will get it. Inshallah. Inshallah. We are left now. Can we? Yes, of course. <laughs> I think it's it's time. We'll end that. Um, yes, we're, uh, we're done for today. Thank you all for attending, and we will see you tomorrow. Inshallah. Inshallah. Thank you, Al-Walid. I'm glad you enjoyed it. All right, good night. <laughs>